at this time, if you could please stand, we're going to stand the Pledge of Allegiance. It's hard to believe that our fourth grade students are about to become middle schoolers. It seems like just yesterday I welcomed them as fourth graders as their new principal. But today we celebrate their accomplishments, growth, and success. I want to thank the teachers, the staff, and the parents for your unwavering support for our students. You have played a critical role in helping them reach this milestone. To our amazing students, I want to say how proud we are of you. You have worked so hard, learned so much, and overcome challenges along the way. You have made lasting friendships, shared memorable, unforgettable memories, and become a part of our school family. As you continue through your educational journey as middle schoolers, I want to offer some words of encouragement and advice. First, always believe in yourself. You are capable of achieving great things you should never let anyone tell you otherwise. Second, never be afraid to ask for help. We are here to support you, guide you, and offer you help when you need it now and in the future. Third, please be kind to others. You never know what someone is going through, and a little kindness can go along the way. Finally, I know that you will continue to do great things and you have a bright future ahead of you. We are excited for you to return in August as middle schoolers and leaders of our building. I want to congratulate our fourth grade graduates. Thank you. At this time, I want to uh, introduce to you our special guest, Martha Sykes. She is going to introduce some of the awards that we have today. Good afternoon, everybody. It's nice to be able to have an award ceremony, a graduation ceremony. We haven't had one for a few years. But uh, it's nice to have it today. Uh, first, we're going to give out our PTO awards. Uh, PTO awards are awards that um, each of the teachers, each of the classroom teachers, pick two students to give an award to every year. And um, as I said, this is the first year we've done this in a while. They get a certificate and also a uh, certificate or an ice cream coat at the Lions Den. Okay, this is from Mrs. Gensel's class. The most improved in math is Amanda Menser. for being the most helpful and polite student. This award goes to Elizabeth Latimer. <laughs> this also is for Mrs. Barr's class. Another most helpful polite student, Christopher Mace. This 
next award that we're going to give out is the Peggy Tripp Memorial Award. Um, Peggy Tripp was a, um, an assistant here in our Title I program, and she worked a lot with the students with reading, and she not only helped them with their reading, but she loved every single one of them. So her family gets this award to uh, a student in each of the grades uh, in, our, in our school from K to four. And uh, like I said, this is sponsored by her family, and also with the certificate, there's also a monetary award. And this award is the Peggy Tripp Memorial Award for a love of reading and an all-around good student goes to Aubrey Haynes. Uh, two fourth grade students by the class of 69 and uh, this award is given in memory of all um, class members that have passed on. Uh, at one time there weren't any um, awards given to fourth grade so my class decided to give uh, a, a monetary award and a certificate to a boy and a girl in the fourth grade class who are the best all around students. This first award goes to Brianna Smith. This next award is given in memory of Martina Rogers, who was a uh, very active and loving music teacher that we had at our school. Um, Anybody that knew Martina Rogers knew that she was very meticulous and detail-oriented in everything she did. But she did so much. She had uh, concerts here. Uh, every March we had a March music concert where the whole school would sing. And um, she did many productions at the high school and many countless concerts and had so many band students and choir students here. Uh, her friends give this award, a uh, music award, to every um, grade. And, uh, because they love music so much, and this year, this year this award goes to Connor Stewart. These next awards are the President's Educating Education Awards Program Awards. And these students are awarded in recognition of their outstanding academic achievement. This first award goes to Madison Dent. This other outstanding academic achievement award, Riley Dunham. Smith. <laughs> 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 Madison Dent. <laughs> 
Madeline Knowles. Those two for the silver awards, I have two gold awards right now. Elizabeth Latimer. Jason Reedus. Sandra Knopf. Just about ready for our roll call. I'm going to call up uh, both fourth grade teachers. We have Mrs. Schultz and Mrs. Bob. James McKee. (laughs) 
Amanda Mincer. Vivian Alpsey. <laughs> Noah Pitt. Aaron Probst. Jason Rita. <laughs> Zachary Shay. <laughs> Brianna Smith. Bentley Snavely. Connor Stewart. Alan Sylvia. Tanner Thompson. <laughs> Jacob Weaver. Chelsea Word. Catherine Winkleman. And Madeline Yole. Each other again. 
And I would like to uh, thank Mr. Heiser for helping me out every year with the slideshow. <laughs> All right, before we wrap things up here, uh, I just want another huge round of applause for a very special school year with our fourth grade students. If we could give them a round of applause. <laughs> fourth grade, we are, we are very proud of you. We're excited to see where you go in the future. Uh, we will follow you every step of the way. So we're excited to have you back as middle schoolers next year. Um, I also have some other thank yous to give out here before we go. So, um, Mr. Heiser, again, thank you for helping with the slideshow and everything that you do here. Uh, Mrs. Volchin, she's our secretary. She does a great job getting our awards uh, printed off, figured out, um, as well as our programs. So I want to thank her. I also want to thank Mrs. Seitz. She was able to give up her day, helped us out with awards ceremony today and then also with our promotion so thank you uh, in the back we have colton confer he is from our technology department he helped to live stream this event for any of those guests at home so thank you colton we really appreciate it um, and then i have one more person i want to thank uh, renova elementary school has been very very fortunate the past two months uh, our fourth grade students our staff and myself have had the opportunity to work alongside and have the support of Amy Clary, our school guidance counselor. Um, I just want to say, <laughs> we have been truly blessed to have her back in the building these past two months. We are excited to see where she goes in the future. And I just want to say a big thank you, Amy. Thank you. And then last but not least, thank you to the parents, the grandparents, the guests that are here in attendance. We really appreciate your support and encouragement throughout the school year. We couldn't do it without you. And that being said, for our dismissal procedure today, the way we're gonna do this, we're gonna have the students, they can meet up with you for pictures and stuff here in the lobby or in the, in the gym here. After they're done with pictures, we would ask that they go back to the classroom. They need to gather up their belongings. But if you want to sign them out, there is a sign-out sheet in the lobby out here. So please feel free um, to hang out in the lobby until they get their belongings and come back to you. Uh, but you are welcome to take them home as long as they're signed out. Again, thank you so much for coming. We truly appreciate it. Have a great afternoon and great evening. Thank you.